What is your first task here at the monastery? Welcome in, Valkyrie. We're playing Please Fire Emblem Three Houses. Once you have finished, come and speak with me. Okay, it is time to take a look around the monastery. Good stuff. Let's get a let's get a handle for what we're up to here. Uh, we can accept the quest slash view the quest. May I ask a favor of you? <clears throat> Uh, speak to the three house leaders, gather information about the students in each house. Students can be found in the reception hall on the first floor and through the officer's academy. This is interesting that I have to accept the, uh, quest. It seems like the most intro quest of all time, and I could potentially decline it? Uh, I'll accept. I guess it might technically be optional. I get some items from it and some 500 gold. Quests are tasks given to you by people around the monastery. Those who can or are involved with quests will have icons beside them. Okay. Um, consult the quest menu to see the quest you have accepted. Icons beside each quest indicate their status. Icons for essential quests are red. Okay. So, to get to that, I have to hit... X menu, quests. Cool. So, it's not necessary. Interesting. Uh, all right. They, oh, this is beautiful. Aloise and Sedith. Uh, y'all want to talk? Ha! I imagine you were a bit surprised that I recommended you as a professor here. Can you ride Rhea to your objectives? Oh, wait. Valkyrie says, I loved it. I've always loved that quest surrounding Morkvarg and Skull. Oh, my God. Morkvarg's quest is insane so far. I love it so much, Valkyrie. Holy shit. It gives me the willies, but I love it so much. Frankly, we had someone else in mind for the role, but they <laughs> ran off during our dust-up with the bandits. I didn't know Can't that. Can't entrust students to someone who's abandoned them once before, huh? You saved the lives of the students you came across. That, at least, was admirable. Now, you should make the rounds. Go around the monastery and see that you greet everyone. I'm on it. I'm on it. All right, we have a door through there. First floor. This is nothing, it looks like. Great. Hold B to dash. Oh, we're fast as hell. Oh, we're so fast. What's in here? I sometimes have no patience trying to talk to everybody in games like this. Okay, there's a little banner there. I wonder if that's like the school banner. Another one there. It is a monastery. I wonder how often this is all rhetorical. I wonder how much the religion actually comes up or if religion comes up to the first floor. Let's go. Oops, do I need to click on it? I do. All public, do you not like the voice acting for Morkvarg? Oh, it gives me the fucking willies, dude. I love it. I absolutely love it. Oh, I can't. It's like incredible. I know that it's uh, it's lots of non-human noises, but <clears throat> cool mini map. Upper right corner of the screen shows your current location, the locations of important people, directions to quest givers, more. ZR changes the. Interesting. Okay, officers academy reception hall. Second floor was the place where I was. But there's lots of uh, occupants up there that I still haven't talked to. I don't hate it. I just think it's funny. Yeah. I mean, that's fair. And and if you hated it, that's cool, too. Um, all right. Real quick. I want to check something. Is there a way to make the light a little bit brighter here? I don't know that I can. Hmm. Uh, all right, this one looks like it. Cool. All right, let's go talk to some people. Hello, who are you? You don't want to talk to me. Okay. It's actually lighter for you guys than it is for me, which is kind of funny. Songstress Dorothy in my class. Is that a tattoo on Petra's face? Mercedes seems a bit eccentric. I recognize some of those names. Y'all want to chat? Nope, that's the full. Sure. Hi. Hello. 
It's also, this monitor, this TV I'm using sucks for brightness. I could turn it up some more, I guess, but. Lorenz is a true noble. Ash is the best, totally unpretentious. Linhart always seems laid back. Edelgard's up there. I don't know who you are. Hey okay. I could take Casper in a fight. Bernadette's always in a room. Hmm. Hi, Edelgard. So you've accepted a teaching position here. Pity. I was hoping you would lend your strength to the Empire. Hmm. I never properly introduced myself, did I? My name is Edelgard von Hressfeld. <laughs> I am the princess and heir apparent of the Adrestian Empire. I wonder the if you are tasked with leading the Black Eagles. I hope you've had a chance to meet everyone. Would you like to know more about any of the Black Eagles? Uh, sure. I'd love to. I don't think I'm going to choose you, but I'd love to. Ooh, I can ask about anyone? Tell me about yourself. Me? Well, some think I'm a bit distant. Arrogant, even. But there's little to be done. One day, I must rise to become Adrestia's next emperor. What else? Well, it seems to me that we may have similar personalities. Dang it, Edelgard. You're more stuck up than I thought you were. Fuck. Uh, oh, no. Multiplies experience earned by 1.2 as the defining ability. Okay. Swamp display. Okay. Great. Uh, what about Hubert? Who's this person? Hubert is the heir of Marquis Vestra. He has served me since I was a child. You may think his blood runs a bit cold, but <laughs> actually that's rather accurate. Sure. Still, if yeah, you I'll try and read past that, you'll see he's Let's quite astute and reasonable. Uh, MT, which I don't remember, um, grants MT plus five with gambits for that person. I don't think I'm going to read through all of these. I'm going to look for anyone interesting. And I may come back to do this uh, again later. Uh, not for the Black Eagles, at least, who I don't think I'll pick. Let's pick Casper, though. He's the second son of Count Burgley's. He has no inheritance in his future, which is perhaps why he's always so eager to prove himself. Oh, man. He's the amount of, like, energetic and rushes headfirst into lineage any and... If he ends up in your care, be sure to keep a close eye on him. Oh, that's kind of sweet, Edelgard. The amount of, like, lineage and uh, positional stuff. Courtly stuff. Very interesting. Adjacent foes suffer Evo minus 10 during combat. Cool. Uh, who was it? Was it Dorothy that somebody else liked? We'll read up on Dorothy. Few commoners have joined the Black Eagle House, but Dorothea is an exception. She's a songstress from a famous opera company in the Empire. I'm not entirely sure what brought her to the Officer's Academy. Adjacent allies recover up to 10% of max HP at the start of each turn. Okay, cool. Interesting. Uh, sweet. So you've accepted a teaching position. So this is going to be the exact same thing. I Shoot. never. I am the prince. I wonder. I hope you've had a chance to meet everyone. Would you like to know? I don't want to know more. Great. All right, cool. Interesting. Dorothy and Ferdinand were the two from my list from Black Eagles. Gotcha. How do I get to meet her to be my friend? She must be a new student. Yeah, lol. You can't go past here? Come on. Let me go past. No? Okay. Wait, we have somebody to speak to here? Wait. Is it this red? As for me, oh, my shit. job is to stand here at this glorious entrance and leisurely watch over the comings and goings of everyone. Make as for me, my job is to stand Fuck. here at this. Wrong button. <laughs> Make folks smile, you know. Yeah, uh, and by that I mean to vigilantly guard this entrance with my very life, no levity whatsoever. As of now, nothing to report. Gatekeeper, people like the gatekeeper. Uh, public wants to start a communist revolution and uh, take down Edelgard. I will say, uh, yes. if I'd known how much Edelgard comments on people's lineages, I might not have uh, liked Edelgard so much right at the start. Aha, uh -huh, I think we might be over Claude's area. Yeah! Alright, let's see if we can pick up any information. You guys want to talk about anything? You can't go past here, of course. Random 
You can't leave the what city and go towards... This is the Golden Deer homeroom. Spotted Leony. Oops. Gatekeeper's the true protagonist. People love the Gatekeeper. What do they love about the uh, the Gatekeeper, if you can answer it without uh, spoiling anything? Scored a teaching gig, eh? Hi, Claude. I hope you are less miserable than talking to Edelgard was. Well, well. Scored a teaching gig here, did you? Talk about a great first impression. I guess that means I'd better introduce myself properly. I'm Claude Von Regan. I'm from the ruling house of the Leicester Alliance, but don't worry too much about all that madness. I'm guessing you don't know which class you'll be teaching yet, do you? I bet you'd like ours. We're not as difficult as the other two. Have you met the folks from the Golden Deer House yet? Care to know more about anyone? Uh, yeah, let's do it. Claude, comment on yourself, please. Can you pet the cats? I'll try. <laughs> Piqued your interest, have I? As luck would have it, I'm pretty curious about you as well. But what's life without a bit of mystery? Let's just spend the next year or so learning about each other little by little. Okay. Um, multiplies experience by 1.2 is the defining ability, by the way. Um, I don't know that I can go through this info. I cannot. Interesting. This is Hilda. Oh my god, this is Speeds' wife. We have to say hello to Hilda. Hilda is the only daughter of Duke Goneril. It seems her father and brother coddle her quite a bit. If you look up lazy in the dictionary, her picture won't be there because she never got around to submitting it. Not too <laughs> unusual for a noble, I guess. Adjacent male allies, by the way, deal three extra damage during combat, which Hilda seems hilarious. Only oh, shit. If you look up lazy Didn't mean to do that. Uh, Ignatz is the one who reminds you of Void. Void, is this He's you? the second son of a merchant family. Since his brother will inherit the business, he's training to become a knight. If you ask me, it doesn't seem like he truly wants to be a knight. He's probably just doing it to please his parents. Here's the thing I didn't check out. Um, Grant's hit plus 20. Was Claude level 1 or 2? <laughs> Still 1. What's like but the stats are 7 total points higher. Interesting. Um, let's click on a random one real quick he just to see. From a 43. Family, but his parents died in an accident. Seems like he's had a rough life. Despite all that, he's just about the most cheerful guy you'll ever meet. Hmm. His passions are training, okay. eating, and actually that's about it. These are going to be our people. So Raphael has a chance to recover up to 10% of max HP at the start of every turn. Lysithia. That's Lysithia a name. Lysithia is the daughter of Count Ordelia and is probably the youngest student here. But watch out, she gets angry if you treat her like a child. As for me, I do it on purpose. You have to make your own <laughs> fun in this place, you know? Uh, Lysithia gets double skill experience earned in battle. Um, interesting. Well, has lots of weaknesses, though? Low strength. He's the heir of Gloucester territory. If you haven't already Lorenz. picked up on him, he's a bit arrogant and fancies himself a ladies' man. I can tell by the rose. Said, deep down, he's really devoted and honest. Though James from Team Rocket, is that you? Talk about his noble obligations ever again. It looks like Team Rocket's blasting off again. He's the heir of Glock. Ah, shit! Said, I clicked it twice. Uh, all right. Let's yeah. meet some of these homies. I said he is youngest, and it has a positive attitude. Spotted Dimitri. Right, Over there, right. gotcha. Dadu has a calm attitude. Felix is a lone wolf. Hello. Hi, Dimitri. How's it going? Y'all don't have any dialogue. Okay. Hello. Goddess, let there be harmony here. All right. There's the religion. Can I pet the cat? Damn it. No, but the cat did just... What the fuck is that? There's a flying horse over there. Is that a Pegasus? Huh. All right, we can speak to Dimitri real quick. Real quick, that would be three. Please accept my apologies for the other day. Zero out of ten. You came to our aid, yet I hadn't even the courtesy to properly introduce myself. You can myself. in the DLC, though. I am Dimitri Alexandra Blathed, Crown Prince of the Holy Kingdom of Fargus. 
Dimitri, why are you making your voice seem lower than it actually is by talking like this? Of course, at the Academy, I am simply a student. And I've heard word that you are to become a professor here. Delightful news. I still have much to learn, but I'm confident I could benefit greatly from your guidance. You're confident? Case, That's so surprising. Welcome to the monastery. I hear you're investigating the different houses here. Did any of the blue lions catch your attention? Sure. Let's see what you say. Let's take a look at your stats. Oh, um, please forgive me. It's difficult to open up on the spot, don't you think? I'm afraid my story has not been a pleasant one. Huh. I do hope that doesn't it color your view It did say that darkness me, lurked. But I understand if that can't be helped. We also leveled up Dimitri to level three, which I'm kind of regretting now. Um, I think the stats between the three are relatively, at least the ability is the same. Uh, I think those stats must be relatively balanced, if I had to guess. Ash, Daydu, Felix, Sil Sylvain. This is the one that some people are talking about. Is the heir to House Gautier. He is a capable person who highly values his friends. That said, well, he's always been a bit of a <clears throat> skirt chaser, so to speak. Pardon my bluntness. I speak with him about it often, but it doesn't seem to help. That was actually really not blunt of you. That was really sort of the opposite of blunt. Um, okay. If a female ally is, ally is adjacent. Oh, Lord. Mercedes as well. And Felix. Felix is my husband. Nobility, but a oh, shit. Fate brought her to the kingdom. She may seem carefree on the surface, but she's I like her actually outfit. a kind soul who pays careful attention to everyone around her. Ah, okay. Interesting. So, defining ability, live to serve, healing an ally with white magic, unit recovers the same amount of HP. That's cool. Also, 57 total stats. I really don't understand stats yet. Um, but that's a lot more stat total than some of the other ones. And then Felix is uh is Strawberry's husband. Felix is the heir to House Fraldarius. He has a bit of a sharp tongue, but He looks like a Fraldarius, I'll tell you that much. Down, he's a good guy. He gravitates toward people who are skilled. Perhaps you would enjoy a friendly competition with him sometime. Uh, Lone Wolf, five extra damage when no battalion is assigned or when battalion endurance is zero. Yeah, I sort of imagine Squirrel Monkey. I, I didn't figure there would be too much of a balance between I the houses. I appreciate your effort. Uh, I was thinking more like looking within the rosters of each house to see who has... So the other thing is that some characters get additional experience bonuses and others don't. And so maybe some of them start a little higher, but they level up slower we'll see cool uh we completed that quest complete oh that was a good sound ah if you don't click a net i rage shit i'm coming uh continue exploring please accept my apology I, annette Dimitri, I, of course delightful uh, i hear you're investigating the different yes house. annette i would not annette want oracle to rage Dominic's niece. She is a talented student who scored extremely high marks at the Royal School of Sorcery. She's cheerful and hardworking. Brilliant, really. Though she can be a bit oblivious at times. I hear she caused an explosion in the kitchen last night. Okay. Um, Perseverance, use Rally to grant strength plus four to a character. To an ally, sorry. Interesting. Um... Okay. Annette. There you go, Oracle. You don't talk to them individually? I think you still... Yeah, yeah, what Squirrel Monkey said. I think you can. Um, I, what I, My understanding is I haven't found any of them around here. Like, these people are just sort of unnamed students who give you some, some hot goss. This However... This is the classroom of the Black Eagle House, which is for students from the Adrestian Empire. Still. Our house leader is Princess Edelgard. There are many other nobles among our ranks as well. There are. This is a robot. This is not a. That is not a student. That is a robot. This is the homeroom of the. <laughs> spotted Petra. Spotted Hubert. I have to say, I love the name Petra so much. After a character from a, a book a long time ago. Ferdinand's smile makes me melt. Hubert's so cute. What? Bernadetta. I 
Bernadetta, this is no stranger. I'm Our Ferdinand. house leader owes this person a great debt. Is that not right? I am Ferdinand von Eyer, legitimate son of the Eyer family, the <laughs> Empire's foremost house. Legitimate Are you son. Going to join our class? I look forward to getting better acquainted with you. Great. Hello. Dorothy. Well, aren't you just lovely? Is this your first time in the monastery? I am Shall Ferdinand I von Eiger. Oh, my name is Dorothea. Before I joined the academy, I was a member of an opera company. Oh yeah, you're the songstress. Empire. You should hear me sing sometime. Go for it. You don't want to just uh, let rip right now. We have Castra. Sorry, Casper and. Is it true you saved Edelgard? That's incredible. The name's Caspar, by the way. Caspar, by the you. way. Linhard. Goodbye. <laughs> Sheesh, Leonard. How'd you get into the academy with those manners? So, are you a student here too? Leonard, be goodbye. You guys are funny. I'm about to teach this fucking class. Wingardium Leviosa. I am Hubert, a humble servant of Lady Edelgard. I heard you came to the aid of her highness. I am Hubert. You have my most sincere thanks. You're intense, this Hubert. This is Petra. Hi, Petra. She has come all the way from oh, Bridget to study I like your in the hair. Empire. Back on her archipelago, she is actually a princess. Yo, I like Petra. In Fodlin terms, she will we'll be see called the heir how she talks. To the Hello, I am called Petra. I, I am like Petra. To be meeting with, uh, no, uh, I am pleased to have met you. I like Petra a lot. All right, Petra's my fave. New favorite character. Petra's my fave. Huh? I think I spoke with everybody. Hey. New favorite character. I am Hubert, heir to Salazar Slingers. <laughs> okay. Uh, all right. So hold up. We need to hit B. Right. I think we can run this way. Oh, we're fucking. We are anime running right now. So quickly. Oh, I can't go that way. <gasps> Look at this good dog. I have to say, this is the funniest animation for an animal. <laughs> It looks so realistic in the head and so not realistic in every other way. I like it though. I like you, little doggo. I like you. Can I pet you? You are a good doggo. Ah, from this angle, it looks more. It looks better. You don't have business here yet. Well, fuck off. I want to. Hi, who are you? What do you want? I am Yuritsa. Yeah, I'm planning on it, Squirrel Monkey. I'm gonna try and get everybody. Especially the uh These the golden the deer. Grounds. Goodbye. That's Professor Quirrell. That's Professor Quirrell for sure. I need to adult and leave. Good luck, have fun. Thanks, Oracle. Thanks very much. Good luck at this uh robotic competition y'all got going on too. Why can't you pet him? I don't have the DLC. I need the expansion pack. Or whatever it's, it's. I think it's called an expansion pass, maybe, for this game. I don't Hello. remember. All right, we're going to find these other co common rooms. Um, yes. Professor's rooms are on the A second moment, floor. Please. We can do that, too. Captain Gerald has returned. Can't go past here. This is where we were once. Uh, ah. And then I think there was a common room over... We can look at a map. Maybe to the left here, though. Nope. Just go ahead and look at the map. That button. Wait a second. I maybe need to go up a floor. Huh? Yes. Can I go through here? No. Okay. There was a common room like here-ish, yeah? I did that. What do you think? Here. There we are. Okay, time for the golden deers. You're that mercenary. Who are you? You must be the renowned mercenary who rescued Claude. James from Team Honestly, Rocket. You should not have troubled yourself over the likes of him. My name is Lawrence Hellman Gloucester. You will want to remember it. Speaking of those names that you have to get right in London or in England, Gloucester. Hi. 
You will want to remember it. That's incredible because I've already forgotten it. Like I'm just going to call you James. So you're the skilled mercenary who saved Claude, are you? Oh, you are? It's such an honor to meet you. Oh my Ignaz god. Victor. My parents are Alliance merchants. I love Ignatius's voice. Like Cynthia von Ordelia. Please do not forget it. Wow. My favorite part of Assassin's Creed is stopping whatever I'm doing to pet the cats. It's safe to say that I'd fist fight Lorenz in a harpy. <laughs> Oops, those are uh, not normal ones. Well, or not actual hey, characters. Are you that mercenary? Hilda. Everyone's been talking about you. I'm Hilda Valentine Goneril, and her name is... M Marianne Van Edmund. Are you joining the Knights of Saros or something? Well, I look forward to seeing more of you. I look forward to seeing more of you. You're a nobody? Just kidding, that's rude. <laughs> this is the very cheery happy guy. Uh, who had like 43 total stats, but I have no idea. He may be cracked. Are you someone's guest? I think he had like an 11 strength. That way, if that's what you're looking for. No, Raphael. That's Captain Gerald's kid. Hi, I'm Leonie Pinelli, Captain Gerald's first and greatest apprentice. I'm sure he's told you about me. Nice uh... to meet you. I'm Raphael Kirsten. Who are you again? <laughs> are you someone's like guest? The I'll do it again. No, Raphael, that's Captain Gerald's kid. Hi. I'm Leonie Pinelli. Cool. Captain nice to meet you. All right, cool. Public, I don't know, but I do it all the time. I can't fucking read, it turns out. Um, hi. I just can't. It sucks. Okay, so that's eight. Sorry, that's seven people. I think that what was think? plus Claude makes eight. Very interesting. All right, let's pop in here. Okay. I have a sudden urge to yell at speeds because of Hilda. Hey, I'm going to be honest with you, Strawberry. Megan and I have been married for uh, almost two years. Been dating for five. Um, I'll be with her forever, etc. Megan can see something from one of my exes on Instagram or something. Um, somebody I haven't talked to in ten years. Somebody I have absolutely no interest in getting back together with. Uh, and she's immediately still like, kind of pissed at me. <laughs> like, listen, I didn't do anything. I did something 10 years ago, but I didn't do anything. <laughs> she still does it. It's funny. Uh, wait, who are you? This classroom belongs to the Blue Lion yeah, yeah. House. Okay. Our house leader is Prince Dimitri. All of us here hail from the Holy Kingdom of Fargus. 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 Let's see. Hey there. Are you the mercenary who saved Sylvain. his highness? It's an honor to meet you. I'm Sylvain Jose Gautier. Feel free to say hi whenever you like. Oh, I love your last name, Gautier. Sylvain Jose Gautier. Huh? And who's this? You don't look familiar at all. Do you work here at the monastery? Oh, mercy. Do you think this is that mercenary people have been talking about? Now that I think about it, that does sound like something Dimitri may have said. I suppose you'll be enrolling at the Officers Academy too, then? Well, it's a Mercedes's to meet voice? You. Oh man, my I hope I don't Mercedes, piss anybody off. And this is my best friend. I'm Manette. It's nice to meet you. Mercedes's voice makes me a little sick to my stomach. Alright. It's like too sweet. Ah. I have heard all about what you did from Prince Dimitri. As a citizen of Fargus, I thank you. He also said you're quite skilled. And he doesn't just say Felix. I look forward to sparring with you. I look forward to sparring beating. with you. Felix, must you always speak of fighting right away? Oh, and uh, you may call me Ingrid. It is a pleasure to make your acquaintance. I know Strawberry loves Felix and all, but... I look forward to sparring with you. Uh, I spoke to you. I did not speak to you. Hi there. You must be the one everyone's talking about. I'm Ash. Great to meet you. <laughs> Hi there. I'm this Ash. This here is Dedu. <laughs> he serves Prince Dimitri. I have heard that you rescued his highness. Words cannot express my gratitude. Should you ever require <laughs> my strength, please know that I will off. hasten to repay this debt. I suppose I should return to Rhea. I have now... Con uh, let me continue exploring for just a second. I have now, I think, 
done everything. Uh, I kind of want to see if I can go to the officer's quarters. We'll see. Or the professor's quarters, whatever they're called. I've never seen you before. Hi. Nice to see you too. Uh, Cyril. Who are you? I'm real busy, so could you please move along now? Okay. Thanks. Okay, now, what else did Lady Rhea need doing today? Nice to meet you, homie. What Here hey, I am again, Gerald! The office of the Captain of the Knights. That said, I'm merely here to assist. Apparently, the current captain is getting on in years. I love how I our the dad captain has a hard time keeping up with the responsibilities of the job. Uh, that's where I come in. It's a very convenient plot point. But I love how our dad was like, oh, Lady Rhea needs some help, and I have no way to say no, and I just absolutely have to drop everything and become a professor again. <laughs> like, ah, oh, well, shit. Uh, it looks empty. A couple rooms in here. I love how in real life when you walk by somebody, they announce the things they're thinking about doing when they're done interacting with you. A crest analyzer. What could this crest be? Wait, say that again? I don't know, it looks kind of like an H. This is my research laboratory. Laboratory. I hard to furnish it with the rare materials and purpose-built equipment required for my work. Oh, chat, I'm going to BRB. Sorry, I have to uh, I have to BRB real quick, okay? Sorry, one second. That's the wrong button. Fuck. Oh, hey, sorry. We're that I was already on the right screen. We're back. Uh had some family drop by unannounced, but uh to bring me some soup. What does this say on the chalkboard? To do? Today. To to of something. Maybe it's a signature. Hey. Oh my god, Todd, that's great. Here to visit? Oh my god, it's you. Should I close the door? Oh, what was I doing with my hand there? Dropping by so soon? I expected we'd take some time, exchange a few smiles as we <laughs> passed in the hall, flirt a bit, you know. Well, you're here now, and I do like a man who knows what he wants. Lock the door. Oh God! Huh? That Lock the door. Didn't phase you at all, did it? What's the matter? Don't you like me? Or? Are you just so innocent you don't understand me? Am I going to get dialogue options here? No, that's it. Okay. Thank God. Whew. That's a lot of pressure. I don't know that I feel like yeah. making a heavy decision like that right away. Just stare at her in total silence. Much better. We are fucking sprinting through here. Holy shit. It's a locked door, or at least I can't go in it right now. This is TikTok music in the background. The grabby hand. The hand was kind of weird, wasn't it? I love that your arms are in your coat sleeves and they're just flapping behind you. Yeah, what's going on there? Is it like a cloak thing? Hold up, let me zoom out. What the fuck is going on with my sleeves? How are my hands... My sleeves are like my arms come out through the through the elbow. Tomas. Welcome to the library. Here you may find literature from the far reaches of Fodland. I am Tomas, the librarian. If you have need of me, do not hesitate to ask. I have worked here for uh, hmm, uh, I have lost track of the decades it seems. Look at these. Full sleeve, but then from here on up it's like slit. And I decided to poke my arm through that so that the sleeve hangs behind me. It's called fashion. Look at that. Huh. Wait, can I go into the library? Maybe, maybe not. All right, cool. We met Tomas. Let's go back to Rhea. To Diaria. Yeah. 
Now I just gotta remember how to get there. I think it's this way and then straight. Let's see. Should see the female main character's costume. I should return to Rhea? I'm happy to. Yeah, let's do it. Audience chamber. This confuses your armies you to make them think you have four arms. Academy thus far. I hope you have found our like halls that. brimming with the vitality of well-intentioned souls. I'll tell you who the most well-intentioned soul is. Your, your physician slash professor who keeps trying to well-intention me into bed. Hmm. I suppose it is time for you to take charge of one of our three Or onto a desk or onto the floor or in I any must note number that of I ways. I am personally against entrusting someone as lacking in trackable history as yourself with such a task. But... It is as the Archbishop desires. Good one, Ryan. Thanks, Mars. The Black Eagles, the Blue Lions, and the Golden Deer. All so different. I hope you've made it a point to get to know each of them. Mm hmm Since you are new here, we have decided to allow you first pick. Manuela and I will take charge of the remaining two houses. Which house will I choose? Well... It's an easy choice, gamers. It's Golden Deer for me. Claude, let's do it. So you have chosen the Golden Deer led by Claude, correct? Hi, Tracy. We're a Hufflepuff. Congratulations. Bye, Your public. Thanks for being here. Its choice, then. Have a great rest of your day. You Hi, Tracy. Welcome in. Open minds with virtue, care, and sincerity. They are all promising youths who bear the weight of Fodlin's future upon their shoulders. I hope you appreciate what an honor it is to lead them. Brother? Oh, I am so sincerely sorry. I did not Flame. mean to interrupt. I am in the middle of something, Flame. Is it urgent? No, no, it's nothing. More importantly, who is this? This is our newest professor at the Academy. Oh my, a new addition to the Officer's Academy. I am so very pleased to meet you, Professor. I am Sedith's little sister, Flame. I am so happy to make your acquaintance. It's nice Let to meet you. Let us focus on the topic at hand. Hmm. There is something you should be aware of. Uh-oh. In a few days' time, there will be a mock battle between the three houses, intended to gauge the current progress of you the You couldn't students. have told me this before I picked? We will be using this battle as an opportunity to ascertain your own abilities Son of a bitch. Well. Please do not disappoint the Archbishop. That is all. Great. What's with the ladies with the green hair? Can they all stop time? I think they might all be able to. Wait, what? Are you really our new homeroom professor? Is that true? You aren't quite what I had pictured. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean that the way it sounded. I was sure you'd be roped into joining the Knights. Don't tell me. You chose this class just to get to know me better, right? I'm flattered, really. All right, gamers, here's the deal. From now on, Ignatz... The one just right here of the, right here, right there. We're calling that person Void. That's Void. Cool. <laughs> Whoops. Now that you're our professor, maybe I should choose my words more carefully. Uh, I don't. Oh, we may have somebody at our door again. What the heck? This one's just a package. All right, it's just the day to come knock on my door. Hey, Ryan, do you mind? I don't mind. I kind of do, actually, but I don't have an option here. Don't. Oh, well, Kingsley. Since we're pretty close in age and all, I suppose formalities aren't all that necessary. One must truly marvel at the exceptionality of this appointment, becoming a teacher to students almost the same age as yourself. How unusual. I've heard you are a skilled mercenary, but I cannot shake my discomfort at your new position. Are you really as strong as they say? Let's see your biceps. I bet I packed on more muscle than you. I doubt that. Apparently, our new professor was personally recommended by Alois, one of the knights. So do we just as all say exactly goes, what's on our minds or what? Eyes. What's more, Teach here is the child of the most renowned former captain of the Knights of Seros. I heard. There's no way a child of the captain isn't worthy. It's simply not possible. I'm going to... First thing I get to teach you as professor. All right? Here's the deal. You don't have to speak out loud every single thought that comes to the front of your mind. 
you can actually decide between what you voice and what you just keep inside. The captain? Who are you talking about? Mind blowing. Captain Geralt, of course. The most notable captain of the Knights of Saros and a peerless mercenary. Uh, he's not that well known. You're exaggerating a bit. You're exaggerating. Huh. It doesn't Always matter Marsh. what you think of him. Captain Gerald deserves nothing but respect. Hmm. Well, after working as a experiment. mercenary alongside a father figure such as he, I have high hopes for our professor. Just because someone is special doesn't mean their children are special too, Lysithia. Assuming that a child is going to be exceptional just because of their lineage is a bad That's idea. That's right, Hilda. Don't you agree, Marianne? Remember that you're playing on classic, so your decisions can also lead to Void's death? Oh, shit, you're right. Well, we can find out for ourselves in battle. I right. can't wait to see what tactics you've learned from the captain. A battle? Shouldn't we have a welcome party or something first? I'll get I just the love the method. How savage. I propose a nice conversation over tea instead. I am more than willing to procure some high-quality leaves. Somebody say some ganja? First off, what? Ganja? Uh, here's my here's my thing. I love the method of delineating between students. Just like, pick a hair color, any hair color. Pick a hair color. <laughs> Why learn their personalities when you could just learn ah their style? Sure. Uh, Lorenz wants to get high as balls. Sure. If I die in the game, do I die in real life? I hope not. Tea? You can't get to know someone over tea. There's no meat involved. It's not a party. Your common sensibilities are grating to my noble ears. Lorenz, shut please the fuck yourself. up, please. Sorry for the bickering, Teach. As you can see, ha, the Golden teach. Deer House is a rowdy bunch. Sorry, not Teach. especially unified. Ha <laughs> ha, my bad, Teach. You'll find nobles and commoners alike here. Those the Golden who are Deer are Power Rangers? Studies alongside slackers. But hey, that just makes your life more exciting, right? I really hope you're looking forward to the year ahead as much as I am. Did he just say what I think he said? You'll find nobles and commoners. People who are dedicated to their stud. And then there's the fucking slackers. Nobles and commoners. Oh my god. Uh, I love it. Unit commands. All right. Is it time for some battle? Is it time? He clearly doesn't have a problem dissing people. That's true. Very true. Hi, Addy. How's it going today? You guys can't see it, but just off camera, Kingsley is absolutely going ham on a Kong. You guys know a Kong? I gave him some peanut butter and a Kong like three hours ago. He's going crazy. There's new places to explore in the monastery. Okay. Uh, this calendar must be 1,000 gold as the funding for this month's activities. Uh, the 30th looks like it might be the battle time. Say, while you're here, How we I'd doing, like Addy? use this device I designed to determine whether the power of a crest resides within you. Okay. Don't hurt a bit. Promise. You don't know about crests? <laughs> well, allow me to tell you everything. Absolutely sure. everything about Great. them. Great. Is your calendar clear? This will take a while. Sure. Crests are a fascinating topic. But before one can dive deeply into said topic, one must first understand what crests are. They are power incarnate. I'm not good, so I'm here for a little pick-me-up and fun. Oh, Addy. I'm sorry to hear that. We can be your pick-me-up. We can be your fun. I'll try to be. They are said to have been bestowed upon humans by the goddess countless ages ago. They exist within the flesh and are passed down through bloodlines. Those who carry crests may excel at magic, display exceptional strength, or any number of boons. Okay. Each crest has its own power, the nature of which is beyond mortal understanding. For now. Welcome to Fire Emblem Three Houses, uh, Addy. We are currently attempting to parse exactly what our job is going to be here. We're at a school. We're a professor at a school. You believe I have a crest? I suspect as much, yes. 
But we won't know for sure unless I look into the matter. As I said, crests are passed down through Give me that blood. sweet, sweet vaccine. Put However, that 5G in my blood. Just because someone carries a crest Let's do it. does not necessarily mean their descendants will inherit it as well. Is this becoming Crusader Only Kings 3? Only a scarce few descendants of a crest's bloodline end up inheriting that crest's power. Perhaps one of your ancestors bore a crest, and you just happened to inherit it. Fun fact, Joe Ziha, Claude's voice actor, played and streamed the Golden Deer and Black Eagle route. I've heard uh, Fire Emblem's kind of like Persona. I get the same feel, at least. I'll be honest. I've played very little Persona, but um, schoolish aged kids, um, combat. The combat is definitely different. Combat is more like turn-based um, rather than hack and slashy is my, my belief about Persona. Um, but yeah. Very different in terms of combat. There you go. Haven't played any of them either. That is how a crest usually presents there you go. itself, after all. So far it's uh so far it's uh some fun dialogue. There's no need to look into it, do what you can to find out. Yes, I'll show you the combat course. here in a second. I'll get to the bottom of it straight or away. Maybe. Now then. Please go ahead and hold out your arm. But we're at a boarding school. Oh, okay. What is this? What is that? A pattern I've never seen before. Is it possible an as yet undiscovered crest has been detected? To think, there are still crests out there that even I am unaware of. How Mainline Persona thrilling. game is turn-based? Oh, I didn't know that. Oh. We have a new crest. Unrestrained jubilation. I have much to consider. You may leave Pardon now. my unrestrained I have jubilation. More research to do in regard to this crest. Yes, so very much more research. But for now, your work here is done. Hmm. Okay. What could this line here be indicating? Perhaps it represents a lack of. Yo, symmetry. I can still hear you, Hanuman. Or perhaps. I can still hear what you. What in the world? Oh, I see. It may be connected to that, but to a greater degree okay. than usual. So crests seem wild. They seem like Crusader Kings 3 stuff you're passing on through your bloodline. I may have inherited one. Um, they give you different skills slash abilities is what it kind of sounded like. Um, we'll see. It's not possible to go into battle with the same appearance as in the monastery. You can set this in the journal by selecting unit appearance. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. That's for sure. You can change the protagonist's outfit to the dancer ensemble in your journal. Okay, quest has been added from chapter 5 of the main story on. I think this is all the game got to update. With each moon, professors of the Officer's Academy receive a schedule for the month ahead. Okay. It notes the days on which events and missions will take place that month. Pay careful attention to your schedule, so that you may thoughtfully plan what you intend to do <clears throat> each month, and when. Are you a teacher? I am a teacher. I'm a teacher uh, who's just barely older than my students. Um, monastery schedule feature features different events on different days. Each week you'll have one day off, when you may choose an activity from the list. Your only option at first will be explore. Select the calendar with the directional buttons to view the schedule. Okay. Okay, so Sunday is my day off, it looks like. Uh, my only option for now is explore. The options that I will get in the future... Exclamation schedule, by the way? Incredible. I'm the son of a very important person, basically, Addy. Rest is spend the last day of the week resting. Motivation of your allies will increase. Mission, take on mission. Sorry, battle, take on mission, auxiliary, paralogue, or quest battles. Seminar, assign a lecturer to hold a seminar that will increase unit skill, experience, and motivation. And explore. For now. Uh, statistics is off. Okay, cool. Let's explore. So this is my room. I thought I heard a girl's voice. I must have been imagining things. Nah, that's, that's, your, that's your dream girl inside of your head who can stop time. Uh, okay. Welcome! It says one at the top. I wonder what that means. Huh. We have a journal. This is where we change our unit appearance. Um, have our different characters. 
Incredible. Bulletin board. Oh, wrong one. Fresh catch. Some of the other characters think that's odd. Yeah, no, we all do. We all do. Stats is like most popular characters, what classes, etc. Oh, okay, cool. We're out of the tutorial now? It kind of feels like it. Fresh catch. Greetings all. Assist me by catching a delectable fish from the for the Saint Sethlian uh, celebration. Okay, we can fish. We can grow vegetables. We can share a meal. Ladies preferred. This is Sylvain. I'll fucking kill I'm going to kill him. I'm going to kill him. Oh, wait, it's Lorenz that I also hate. Hi, Orangutan. How's it going? Claude sucks. Edelgard did nothing wrong. I wouldn't know yet. I'm going in completely blind. Uh, I wonder if I can actually dormitory to unlock the ability to fast travel. Cool. We get renown points as well. Speak with your house leader. All right, let's do it. There's Sedith. These are the students' are quarters. The students' quarters. To better help you supervise them, you also have a room here. Your room is here at the end. Commoner students also reside on the first floor, while the second is primarily for students of noble birth. As a rule, we try to avoid discrimination based on social status. Yeah, here. I'm gonna call bullshit the on that one. Can be quite insistent when yeah. it comes to matters of propriety. Speaking of, it would be best for you to avoid improper conduct. I expect you to set a good example for the students. So no sleeping with my fellow professor, or... Okay. Is that what... <laughs> I'm not too keen on the professor of my class. Ooh. I really hope to focus more on strategy. Hmm. Maybe I should talk to my professor about transferring to a different class. Okay. Spotted Dimitri and Daydu. Daydu was one of the people I could uh, have a quest with. Let me know when you are hungry. You want to share a meal with some... I will some... make you a quality meal. Oh, never mind. As thanks for your service to his highness. Game is not the best at respecting the player's time, even though I love it. I have a request. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, Dedu is the one who grows stuff. Okay, sure. I'll accept this quest. Sure. Take Dedu's seeds, ask the greenhouse keeper how to grow and harvest crops. Sure. Do some gardening. I I'd love to do some gardening. Mock battle. I want you to know, Professor, that I do not intend to lose. Yeah, well. I hereby declare my intention to prevail at... Goodness, listen to me. The thrill of competition has carried me away. I won't speak so formally of the class assignment in the future. Goodness, listen to me. <laughs> my dear. Dimitri. Hilda. Uh, the red one. This is our house leader. Cool. Claude. Got it. Red means it's that quest. Did you Got hear it. the news, Teach? Looks like we're going to have a good old mock battle <laughs> between teach. the houses. The Golden Deer House <laughs> isn't exactly what you'd call an elite so. group just yet. So you may want to whip everyone into shape with some extra training. Oh, I'm planning After on all, it. Let's do it. competition is only fun if you win. <laughs> to that end, I'd better prepare as well. You know, I was researching what it's like to live here long before I even enrolled. Want me to fill you in, Teach? Here is a question I have, a front seat question. Uh, what series is this in the game? Or what game is this in the series? There's a bunch of them, right? Um, there's at least two others, I think, that I saw while Googling. All right, a guide to, uh, let's do facilities Students first. Students and teachers of the Officers Academy are all free to use the facilities within the monastery. That means you can chow down with students at the dining hall or get in some one-on-one -on -one sparring at the training grounds. 16th? As you explore the monastery, try visiting the various facilities and talking to the people who live here. They don't rely on other stories, uh, other story-wise, if that's what you're worried about. No, I was just, I was like, uh, just trying to, a little conversational, I would have, I would have thought it would have been like the fourth one though, third or fourth. What the fuck? So we're talking like, similar to Final Fantasy in that way? Where they all maybe take place in the same universe? Kind of like Final Fantasy, that's what I'm saying, Addy. If you haven't noticed, there are bulletin boards in various places around here. You can check them out to see posted requests or to find more information about the Just market. like The Witcher. Got I it. hear that fulfilling requests can even earn you the right to use more facilities. 
The bulletin board gets updated frequently, so it's probably a good idea to check it once a month. First six were only released in Japan. The series came to the West in 2002. Had a big revival around 2012. So 2002. Uh, that would have been Game Boy Advance, right? Era, and then on to like DS from there. Wow. Far be it from me Activity to tell points. you how to use the facilities, but it's a good idea to be mindful of how you're using your time. The thing at my top of my screen. If you don't right. think about how you're spending your free time, it'll be over before you know it. Okay, and I'm over here chatting to people. Certain activities will only be available when you have an activity point, which is the one at the top of the screen, it appears. Um, when you're done exploring, press the L button to end your free time and proceed to the next week. Okay. Here professor at the level. Officers Academy, even professors are expected to study often to help maintain their strong leadership skills. In other words, students and teachers alike have to strive to grow in every possible field. Tracy's eating blueberries for breakfast right now, and they're divine. Okay, so I got to level up my professor level for sure. That gets me more activity points, maximum activity points, which I can then turn into more learning and shit. Cool. Speak with your house leader. Done. Uh, okay. You're sitting this one out. What does that mean? About the mock battle that's coming up? What do you mean? You don't mind me sitting it out, do you? As a fragile maiden, I'm useless in battle. What the fuck? I'll just cheer everyone on instead. Fragile maiden, Hilda, we gotta talk. I'll see you in my uh in my class on modern feminism. We're reading a room of one's own currently. Um you could really get a kick out of it. Uh what the heck? Hilda? What the fuck? That's the wrong button, fuck. Menu roster. Why does Hilda think she can skip out on this battle? Hilda, what's going on? Uh, you're level one, but you have 29 HP. Advocate, I don't. I think I actually looked at that one earlier. Adjacent male allies. Yeah. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 shoot. We also have... Okay, we're just getting familiar with the menu right now. We have skills. We have... Oh, to next level. And then it's a uh, amount of experience points. I wonder what the different... I think this means... Uh, ooh. Okay. That must be related to... Sorry. A person's, uh, a person's, like, likes and dislikes or whatever. Uh, their ability to... It's just the laziness. Oh, my God. Ma'am, quit this school. They have, like, uh, advantage and disadvantage on certain things, basically. Uh, Lance and Axe have blue. All right, cool. Anyways, uh, cool. Hello. Hello. So, I'm not sure about the same universe. Some of them occur in the same universe. Some others uh, don't, as far as I know. After a couple hours of playing it, are you enjoying it? Surprise is not here, right? Mod check? Can I get... Do we have the mod check emote? We do, right? Shit, how do you spell it? Shit, how do you spell it? We have the mod check email. I don't remember. Um, As it were. I'm enjoying it more than Persona for sure. I'm enjoying it, yeah. This is the kind of game where I can imagine throwing 500 hours into it. <laughs> can I? Will I be doing that? I still don't know, but I can't imagine it. Students' quarters. To better help you supervise them. We already talked. Never mind. I'm a dummy. Speaking of. We already talked. Uh, that was my shit. Cool. So, oh, the quest things do appear on the mini-map. This game is better than Persona. There you go. Oh, there's a stairs right here. I could just go down the stairs. That's what I should have done. There we go. For what it's worth, you didn't play Persona. You played its spin-off. Right, but that's less funny as a joke. There it is. How do you spell that fucking emote? Lost? All lowercase, first three, capital C. All right. 
I can never remember how you spell that one. Uh, Leon, Leony, Leony, Leony. Nope. Can we chat? First and best apprentice. I can that was you. Professor, even you, if I have to. It I might play Persona Five when it comes time, to Switch. I, I also might. Absolute best. We'll see. Yeah, I'm having a lot of fun. I uh, I am a huge sucker, as as many of you guys know, I'm sure. I am a huge sucker for anything that lets me level up early and often. And it appears with each of these characters having many, many opportunities to level up. Let's look at my own. Oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. I'm excited by that. Hello. How do you do? Hi. London is the capital of Great Britain. I'm fine, thanks. Hi, Ted. I, uh, How are you? You're fine, thanks. Uh, Bernadette. What the fuck? That was weird. That was weird. Okay, something sus about Bernadette. <laughs> like to come out unless I really have oh, you're just to. nervous? Thanks What's for the 25 bits, that, Ted. Law says I didn't actually remember how you spell that emo. I just eliminated from what you typed. It is like the one option I didn't type. I keep thinking I can jump here. All these well, lovely ladies. Dorothea, Hilda, and Mercedes. Lady Rhea is quite the beauty too. And I must admit, I've even checked out Professor Manuela once or twice. Oh God. You know, Professor, I think I'm oh, going God. to like it at the Officers Academy. There are beautiful girls as far as the eye can see. Oh God. <laughs> Don't you wink at me like that. No, 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 no. Don't you wink at me like that. I've got a small favor to ask. Try sharing a meal with others in the dining hall. You can even treat someone to their favorite meal. Talk to the dining staff for details. I'll do that, sure. Um. Yeah, I'll eat with others. Sylvain is Ryan when the camera's off. I'm gonna vomit. Who should I invite, though? It's probably... So here's the other thing I'm, I'm curious about, right? We have our roster. I don't see yet on this a place for a like relationship tracker. I'm thinking it's got to be there somewhere. Look at these different crests, by the way. Because uh, we've seen relationship tracker go up or down based on different things that have happened. These are classes. Notes? Maybe it's here. Close allies. Oh, shit. I don't know. I'm looking forward to finding it out eventually, but... Um... I'm nervous about the mock battle. Yeah, well, I would be too if I were you. But not on my team. This place is fucking huge, by the way. Whew! Just looking in the wrong menu? That's alright. I'll get to it eventually. It's just enough to me to know that it's out there. Um, dining staff. Hi, Barjo. Watching the Below Zero playthrough is giving me that feeling you felt when you started playing. Aww. I'm so happy to be playing it. Today, I got into a Starbucks and bought a cookie. Had to ask for a refund. Because it wasn't <laughs> nearly as sweet as your smile. Yo, what? Ted is hitting on me. Ted, you should be in this game hitting on all these. You should be. You're Sylvain. I said 25 bits. Not as sweet as you are, Ted. Not not as sweet as you are. Or something. What's today's special? Uh. Wait, today's special is... Wait, no, that's who I share a, a meal with. Select the first person you'd like to share a meal with. Um. Today's special is Sagart and Cream, a baked confection coated with Noah fruit cream and a current reduction often enjoyed as a dessert at family gatherings wait a second is it only females hold up wait a second oh no i thought i didn't have oh no oh god these people have happiness bars i think it's because they're in they're on my team yeah oh no how am I supposed to remain objective and above re and above reproach? And how am I supposed? Oh no! How am I supposed to remain professional 
Oh god. Professor eating first day eating lunch. Oh no. Maybe I should, I should go for somebody who hates me. Uh, Petra? Petra? Let's go with Petra. Like the second person? Manuela for sure. 100%. Petra and Manuela together? Oh no, they're going to be fighting. I don't think it's only female choices if you're the female main character. I can imagine that. Is it only male characters the though? The food of Fonlin has great strangeness. Professor, would you like to eat my helping? I've had enough and need to stay in shape. Professor level. Love it. Uh, that was our one activity, I think. You'll well, usually want to finish exploring when your activity points run out. Press the L button to do so. Okay. Nice. I knew I could count on you. So that was our one thing that we could do. Beautiful. Quest complete. I received an onion, a turnip. Oh, shoot. 